every college, every school that has a flat top, okay, could actually support itself energy-wise. Also, homeowners that have that are facing the right way, well, there are companies out there that will allow that will actually put solar paneling on their house for free. Well, there's there's two there's two issues. One, solar power is not efficient nor reliable enough yet to be used as an energy a widespread energy source. And number two, you're using my money and what I pay in electric rates to subsidize that power source that has no future. There, are, there is a company in Canada too that does not get subsidies. So you know, it's just because they get subsidies doesn't mean it's not a doable thing. We have pretty clean air. Uh, we've reduced the number of ozone days from over a hundred to maybe four or five over summertime in, in New Jersey. It's been tremendous, a tremendous difference. We will not have perfect air unless we stop human activity. Water and solar, these are the things that are important. These are the things that will save our future, save our planet, and save... Oil and gas and coal and nuclear no longer are effective ways to generate power. For whatever reason, we will ultimately find another way to do that effectively and reliably, and solar might be included in that grouping.